Yo guys, welcome back to this brand new FIFA 19 video. This is a video on the reason why you should open bronze packs and why it's so beneficial for uh, FIFA 19. Beneficial every single FIFA, but people don't realise um, how many coins you can actually make from it. So as you can see, I've opened up a lot of bronze packs. I've got 1,200 players in my club. Um, and yeah, as you can see, I've just got the most of the leagues. Literally every single league I've got a bronze player from. Premier League are just cleared out, but apart from that, and the championship are cleared out as well because um, the SPC that just came out. But apart from that, literally, League 1, League 2, main leagues I don't have a lot. Um, but League League 2, um, Calcio B, all them leagues, like that, the average leagues, all of these. Um, it's worth just definitely keeping them because then, as you can see, when an SPC comes out, say for example, a, a live SPC will be on here. Say the new marquee matchup comes out and it requires players from the French League too, then um, the players that are in that in that league that you've got in your club, you can definitely sell them for a lot of coins. Like it's just easy, easy coins again. Um, so I'll open a few bronze packs and just show you like what what you should do, best ways to do it. Uh, it's it's fairly simple, but most people still don't do it. Um, main reason because they can't be bothered, but it's definitely worth it. Like as you can see straight away here, this is just the first pack, so you can see it's nothing. It's not like I've been sat here for ages waiting for this. Anyway, it's 200 coins, so confirmed 200 coins. German, German League 2, so it's worth selling him. So you'll get 200 coins of him eventually, no matter what. So there's already half the pack back, and then the rest of this, so you can keep them two players, and eventually. As you can see, Scottish League, so they're not great leagues, but it's still worth keeping in case any SPC comes out. And it's just good to store to your club anyway, and then you get all these consumables. You can probably try and sell this. It probably won't sell, but there's still a chance it might. But anyway, I got I got 228 coins back from the pack from spending 400. And that's a bad pack, so imagine what a good pack's like. So you can get you can get good packs where you'll get a player that's worth about 6k, stuff like that. Like instantly again he sells. 200 coins again, maybe 150. But there's already 200 coins back. You discard the kits, keep that, and then you've got another two players here I've already got. Uh, again, but let's say, for example, we sell both of these, and then that's 600 coins. Um, so there's 200 coins profit again, plus you get the contracts, plus the other 30 coins there. So again, like you make, you're not you're not losing a lot, but you're not making coins yet. But that's what I mean. But when it gets further on, eventually you'll get a player like, for example, this guy. Maybe does he sell? Wait, why has he got a price range of 12k? Um, anyway, you'll get a player like this guy, for example, who doesn't sell right now, but eventually you will. But I'm gonna list him for 350 because I should get that for him. So 350, that's already literally the pack back. Plus you got this here, um, so that's another 300. So there's there's 200 over the pack. Plus we got this guy as well. Now he's uh, I'm gonna keep him. But already we've made profit on the pack. Plus we've got another three players and four contracts, and then we discard that for nine coins. So there's profits overall from the three packs. I would say we're about we're about equal, almost maybe 100 coins down, something like that, from three packs. Uh, it's not paying out too well right now, but definitely I've made I've made about 300,000 coins or so from um, from SPCs. No, from bronze packs, sorry. But again, look, this guy sells. So there's another four or five hundred coins. So there, there's a pack back again. Plus you get the contracts and this spare guy. So there's 200 eventually. So there's profit again. So overall, I'd say we're about equal now. Um, they're not selling yet, obviously, but all it takes is one big player that's required for an SBC, and instantly there's like 20 packs paid for, you know what I mean? Because you'll get profit. Sometimes you'll pack a player that's worth about 8k. But again, that pack's not great, so we'll store to the club for the future and then take the 200 coins. Um, we'll check this pack as well now. This We'll just do one or two more. So there we go. Look, he's um he's rare, so he should sell straight away. There's there's uh, 300, 200 coins, so it's not great at all. It really ain't great for him. But still, 200 coins. I probably should keep. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep him, yeah. Um, because he'll definitely go up. Say for example, the the MLS SPC comes out like last year, Giovinco. Someone like that, you're gonna 100% make coins on him. Like you'll 100% sell for about six, for about three, four, five, six k, something like that. So it's just worth keeping. Like right now, it it looks like you're not making profit, but trust me, as soon as one good SPC comes out, then your coins will go flying up, and you can sell them on and make a lot of coins, improve your team. Um, 
So we're getting here, not a great pack. But we can sell these two on. Eventually they'll sell for 200 each. And then when they do, there's a pack paid for again. Plus you get all the other items. So obviously, it's not the quickest way of making coins. It's quite slow to be honest. But if you've got a lot of patience and you're happy opening bronze packs and you enjoy it, then it's worth doing it. But if you're obviously impatient and stuff, I'd recommend sniping. I'd recommend other methods that are on my channel. Uh, if you go to the web app trading videos. Um... But yeah, it's not, it's not paying out too well right now, but this is the best way to um, to make coins, in my opinion, easily. So just from that little pack opening, I've done about, what I'd say, six, seven, eight packs. Um, overall, I'd say probably lost a few coins, probably about five, six hundred coins. But again, I've got 1,270 players in my club now. And um, yeah, definitely. Uh, all these players are going to go up in price that I've got in my club eventually. If not, then what you do is, um, so say for example, I get I get uh, all these players in my club, and then I get duplicates of them players like I have been in those packs. I can go to squad build and challenges, and then keep in mind the ones that you've got duplicate and trade trade them into the bronze upgrade, and then trade them in until you get 11 silver players, and then trade them into the silver one, and then you get three gold players, and before you know it, you've got a gold upgrade pack. You can pack anyone in. Like I've already packed Neuer in one. Like it's just a it's just a process of easy coins and getting improving your team, getting better players. It's very easy to be honest. But yeah, I really hope you enjoyed the video and it helped. Um, if you want to see anything else similar to make coins, like there's a lot of other methods, sniping, uh, max bidding, just everything like that. Uh, then definitely subscribe for more and uh, leave a comment to tell me what you'd like to see. And yeah, please like, share, subscribe and peace.